Excellent. Yes. yes Arresty support forms. Police threatening to clean sidewalk chalk. Yes. Really? I gotta take a picture of that because that's a statement like that, you know. Threatening to clean sidewalk chalk. What was written in the sidewalk chalk? That uh, a, a hopscotch board, um, some children's things that say, you know, real peace and happiness. And real stuff. disturbing stuff. Yes, yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I'm just curious, like, you know. They can call it the city of Well, if it's sidewalk chalk, I mean, it's kind of. Well, no. Officially, it's graffiti. The only reason yeah. they don't yeah, prosecute yeah. your children is because people use it for children. Well, I've got a driveway, so I can do it on my exactly. driveway. But yeah, yeah, yeah. If I was in an apartment here, I guess, where would you play hopscotch, right? Yeah. Was this always here, this vegetable garden? It's been here for a while. I don't remember how long. I mean, I've only been here for two days, so I couldn't tell you. Yeah. Well, I mean... But yeah, it's, it took a while for them to gone, get the yeah. parks done here after yeah. the so-called Big Dig was done. Yeah, so it's, um, I know that it's been community gardens for a while. People okay. People are like, oh, like, yeah, well, everything is, like, it's dying now. It well, the sunflowers are kind of done, right? Yeah, the sunflowers are kind of done. The um, tomatoes are almost Those over. are, what are those, beans? Bean poles? No, laughing idea. It kind of looks like beans. Yeah. I mean, yeah, it's the end of the season, really. Nothing's going to grow now. So, yeah, but, you know, we'll have stuff again in the spring. Wow. <laughs> Sidewalk chalk. Yeah. That just cracks me up. Sidewalk frickin' chalk. Wow. Well, well, good luck. I mean, I'm, I'm visiting and seeing what's up. Where? Pepperell, Mass. Well, the outer suburbs of Boston. It's good to have you here. Thank you. My name's George, by the way. I'm Spider. Spider? Yes. But not Spider Man, obviously. No. I'm just checking. It's just a nickname. It's cool. It's cool. I grew up on the muds and all that. Yep. Well, have a good day. Ciao. PB and J. Nice. Waste. There's a lot of waste of food. Food servers only give small amounts for now on. Yeah, no. <laughs> Oh, they don't. Whoa. Hey, Ben. Really? Up. Excellent. Apples, vegetables. Wow, fresh carrots. Holy smokes. No, the government won't bail me out. That is the answer. That is in fact. Whoa! Abolish the ruling class? You're sucking his freedom from him. taking his freedom from him. Okay. So I go up in a place where I, I need the Terminator and I go to the dark side of the moon and then Spielberg is there and there's a kid underwater in the eye. Okay. Nobody for president. <laughs> if, you, if you can't make a crossover with all this. Can I have one of those stickers? Can we go to a nursing home and we want to get you and your Medicaid to pay for it? Get two beds because I'll be your caregiver and I'm here to liver. So I'll wait for your seasons as this and I'll get a habeas corpus and I'll get your liver and Steve Jobs can spend his billion dollars. That sounds like a wonderful plan. Steve Jobs can keep his billion dollars. But in the meantime, in the meantime, I went over to the desk and asked them. Yeah, okay. Thanks. Hey, it's this guy. What's going on, man? Hey, tell me your name, you guy. I get it. But I'm done. Thanks. I'm sorry. I'm just you, nope. Talk right here. It's all good. Wanna, yeah, I'm just kind of check things out. Yeah, sure. It's, uh, I'll be honest, I <laughs> never really met an open <laughs> anarchist <laughs> before. Well, no, I did. Back in high school, there was a few. Yeah, but now that I'm in the so called corporate oh, world. Oh, table full of Nice. Ruling class. I, I took a picture of this because I just wanted to kind of have a list in my head. Oh, that's not complete. No, but um, it kind of says it, right? Yeah. All major institutions. I mean, you know, I thought I was doing the right thing. Got a job, bought a house, have the wife and kids, and 
Now my house is worth less. The bank's like, F you because you earn too much or whatever. But I don't earn, I earn just enough to like have a minivan and feed the kids. Is your uh, house uh, in the red now? What do they call it when it's worth Underwater. Less? Underwater. Oh yeah. Hugely underwater, dude. Here's the thing. So now I'm a prisoner. You are. That, you're a debt you. Or I could... And that's against yeah, you're my own morality. I could, uh, I mean, there's a, there's a I could, right I could try and walk like, away. Uh, like group but I, I got two kids, you, two yeah, little kids. Uh, I mean, what am I going to do? Uh, story, I'm sure be well, so. here's the thing: on the housing bubble, the whole thing could have been solved. Uh, all they had to do was buy out about three million uh, underwater homes. It would have been a pittance. Yeah. That would have put the foundation back under the housing bubble. Very simple move. And, and so solve the homeless have, issue, probably. But they didn't in a do way. That. What they wanted to do was protect the, the, the gamblers, the casino. Well, the, the, the debt. all their mortgage wrapped up with the insurance and all that BS, and I'm like, and the derivative. Really? They packaged all those damn mortgages the derivatives. And like the school district's investing in that, and they get screwed, and you know. Well, I think that's what started this whole movie. <laughs> yeah. So blatant. You left? Wall Street. They picked a good time. <laughs> I mean, I was very much with my friends. Like, why are we bailing these people out? They're the ones that screwed up. Let them, let them go bankrupt. That's what bankruptcy's for. So, so what do we do? We rewarded the people that fucked up, and now we've got banks that are even bigger. Five of them came here. Five big, massive banks. Bigger. A lot of little banks. Yeah, it's just. Mind boggling. So, we have to make the connection with not just greedy. Well, so, the way the system works. Well, there's, there's capitalism and then there's oligarchy, right? Not really. No? Uh, capitalism goes through phases. Yeah. Productive on the real economy and then. Overproduction, and then the, the profit motive, profits get harder, and so they switch to speculation on the financial sector. Right. Like every 60 years. This time it's different because of the computers. Of these million dollar bets for a few minutes. Yeah, or seconds. And or the amount of capital sloshing around looking for investment. Yeah, if it, was, if it was people handing papers across, it might be a little less bad. And they're betting right? on everything. They can bet oh. on currencies, they can bet on grain prices, and they can inflate the grain prices. Yeah. And just, uh, you know. Um, and if I understand right, oil was not a commodity that you could gamble on until like 20 years ago or most something. Most of that recent peak, not all of it, but most of it was from speculation. Right. Yeah. Why is it $170 a barrel? No, no real reason, right? And then suddenly it goes down. Oh. Yeah. No reason. And that hurts everybody. It does. Right. Oh, prices. yeah. You know, the average person trying to drive to work or whatever. Yeah. Even worse, though, was the spike in, in uh, basic grain. Because that, yeah. that brought a billion people to the edge of the car. Exactly. Like this whole ethanol thing. Yeah. Why are we turning food into fuel? It's ridiculous. Ridiculous. Especially when the EPA says you don't need ethanol in your damn gasoline anymore. Well, okay, let's take the corn and food people. <laughs> well, it is. Yeah, it helps destroy it. Yeah, it's, it decays it's... a lot of the metal parts. Yep. So. <sighs> Dead the first 5,000 years. You guys got a whole lot of cool stuff here. Yeah, this is historical stuff, and this is more current. No, that's not current. I do have a current essay. Dear Occupiers, a letter from anarchists. Hmm. Oh, yeah, that's free. This is a... That's free? Crime think. It's um, it's, it's a good statement. They trash, sort of halfway trash democracy at the end. But right. Great. Okay. But they're... Uh, major wing of American anarchism. Don't fetishize obedience to the law. Yeah, slavery was legal. <laughs> and the Nazis had laws too. Those are pretty good freaking points. Spot on. Uh, yeah. Here's a, 
a pretty good essay comparing what's happening in Spain with the United States. Oh, okay. One of our brightest people. Hmm. Once again, I disagree with his take on democracy. I believe in direct democracy. Okay. Those are quarters, not one another. Cool. Where's the most historical one, like a chronology of energy? I'm out of it. You're out of it? I'll have to bring some more tomorrow. It's a wonderful essay. On well, it. slave, go get me some. <laughs> I'm just trash. Historical and deduction of capital uh, energy. Yeah. There's no, I don't have a chronology. I have some historical statements. Okay. I, um, I'll go with that if you want. One of the founders. I'll buy that for a dollar. One of the founders. Oh, they have a map posted. I'll have to come around a little earlier tomorrow, I guess. I didn't see you here when I was here on was no. it Thursday. Uh, I came late, though. Uh, I was out a couple days because of the rain. Yeah. And, uh, well, it was nice talking to you, sir. I'm yeah. going to move on. Okay. Thank you so much. Yeah, you're welcome.